Hello, I'm Vince Minardo with Enable AI. Today I'm here to walk you through how to use our mobile freezing of gate assistant, Enable Balance, which can be downloaded through the App Store on an iPhone. The information in this video can be found in written form on our website, enable.me, listed as user guide under balance. This is the first screen that you will see when you download Enable Balance onto your iPhone. To begin, you will need to create an account or log into account if you've used Enable Balance before. To do this, click the sign in button in the upper left hand corner. If this is your first time using Balance, go ahead and click Create New Account listed under Sign In. Here, you will be prompted to choose a username and a password that you would like to use to log into your account. Furthermore, you can enter your email and your phone number that you wish to be linked to your Balance account. Once you have done this, a confirmation code will be emailed to you. You can go ahead and enter this confirmation code on the next screen in order to complete account creation. Once you have created your account, go ahead and log in. Enter your username and your password, and then click the blue sign in button. If at any point in time you forget the password linked to your username, go ahead and click the Forgot Your Password button, also located under the Sign-In button. Next, you will be prompted to subscribe to Enable Balance. In order to have access to all of Balance's features, you will need a subscription. Please note that every choice of subscription period includes a one-week free trial. If you are displeased with the application at any point in time, you may cancel your subscription through the App Store. If you cancel your subscription during the one-week time period, your account will not be charged a single penny. If you have a promotional code, you can also enter this code through the App Store. If you have a promo code, click the App Store application on your iPhone. And then in the upper right hand corner, click the image, which is your Apple account. Then go ahead and tap the Redeem Gift Card or Code, which is the third prompt down in this menu. Here, you can either use the camera of your phone to take a picture of the promotional code or you can go ahead and enter it manually with the You can also enter your code manually button. If you do not have a promotional code, go ahead and choose a time period. You will see some subscription information text pop up, as well as links to our privacy policy and our terms of use. These documents can also be found on our website if you wish to view them at a later time. Go ahead and click continue once you have clicked the time period that you desire. Once you have purchased a subscription or entered your promotional code, you will need to log in to your Apple account on at least one prompt. Since I already have a subscription linked to my account since I've used the application before, I'm not able to show you these screens. But please note that when it prompts you to enter your username or password, this is a password that is linked to your Apple account, not to the account that you have just created in the Enable Balance application. After you have signed in and you have obtained an Enable Balance subscription, you will be asked to activate a few settings on your iPhone in order for Balance to have its full functionality. First, you will be prompted to allow Balance to access your location. When you select Always Allow, this will allow Enable Balance to run in the background of your phone, even when your phone screen is locked and turned off. If you select Only While Using the App, then you will need Enable Balance to be open on your phone while it is in your pocket in order for it to run and have its functionality. We strongly recommend using Always Allow. Next, you will be asked to allow Enable Balance to send you notifications. Please allow notifications as this will allow you to confirm or deny when freezing of gate events have occurred. When you confirm or deny when freezing of gate events have occurred in Enable Balance, the performance of the application will improve over time. However, if you choose not to allow Enable Balance to send you notifications, you can always access information about your freezing gate events and confirm or deny whether or not they have happened in a later screen, which I'll explain later in the video. Lastly, please ensure that background app refresh is enabled on your iPhone. You can do this by going into the settings application on your phone and scrolling down to general. Then tap background app refresh and ensure that it is on. If at any time you wish to adjust these settings that are associated with your iPhone, you will need to go into your settings application. 